Alright, so I didn't think I was going to get to make a video about this until next summer because it's getting really cold out there and just don't really have a use for it right now, but I thought I'd go ahead and make a video. It's a very nice day out here in Iowa. A nice uh, solid 55 degrees there. So I thought I'd go ahead and talk about the uh, moon roof. Um, so this is a um, optional item that you can add on. A lot of people are not adding it, mostly because it is a very high constrained item out there on your order. So if you put it on, you know, it's just like Ford's just going to make, a, you know, all the other vehicles where they don't have to do that cut out in the top and they don't have to add that extra panel of glass and all that kind of stuff. So plus it's a... Oh geez, what is it? Um, thousand dollars? Yeah, I think it's nine hundred ninety-nine dollars uh, for an add-on. So you know, it's like, do you want to spend a thousand dollars just for an extra window? Mm -hmm. But I like moon roofs. Um, I think they give a nice sort of atmosphere. It's nice to, especially in the summer, and in Iowa here, it can get really hot and very humid. Um, we are known for humid summers, so. It's nice to have that up there. I once had a convertible as well, and I miss that feeling of just being able to put the top down and feel the wind come in from the top. So this sort of is like a middle ground to that <laughs> in a kind of way. But I like moon roofs. Um, and my old vehicle had one, so I didn't want to downgrade. I didn't want to not have one because I did have it on the other. Problem is that on my other vehicle, moon roof stopped working like two weeks after I got it after I got the vehicle, it was used. So somebody probably used and abused it. Uh, the motor went out in it. Uh, it would go backwards, but it always had trouble coming shut. So I stopped using it because it was just like, I didn't want to open it and then be stuck with it open and not be able to do anything about it. And so I just left it alone. I didn't use it. I was fine with it. It was whatever. I took it to the dealership, they fixed it after two weeks of me having it, but then the motor went out like a month after that as well. So apparently they didn't really fix it, but yeah. Anyways, on to the Maverick, cause this one is definitely in top shape working order. Here is the moon roof. So with this, you can make the judgment if you want it or not. Really, it just comes down to preference. Do you want a moon roof? Do you not want a moon roof? The $1,000, it's whatever add it into your order, you pay it off, you know, you know, it is what it is. You pay it up front, however you want to do it. Cool. But you know, everything's going to be costly, but yeah, uh, let me go ahead and show you how it works. So nice thing with this, like most moon roofs, you can push it forward here. If you hit the, the front facing button, that just tilts it up to the back, so you just get a nice little slipstream, airstream coming in. Um, and then you can just push the backward button to go ahead and close that again. Never mind, you hit the same button, hit the forward button again. That'll close it. So that's just the, um, the front button's just a tilt up, tilt down. And then once it's completely down again, you can go ahead and hit the back button. And that will completely open it. Yeah, I think it's a pretty nice size moon roof, especially for such a small cabin. Like this really is like it's almost half of the it's almost half of the cat the top there. So it's not like it's not bad. Um, I definitely feel the air coming in. It's fun to also just look up and see the sky. Nice thing is too, if you've got the adaptive cruise control on, I've made videos on that, go check those out. But if you have that feature on, you're just kind of hands free and just, you know, being kept in the center of your lane, you're on a nice highway and expressway where there's just complete straight roads. You don't have to worry about it losing, you know, the lines because of turns and things like that. You can be driving hands free and just, you know, it might be a night, like today, there's not much to look at up there. <laughs> you can just look at the blue and it's just blue, but there's not like cloud in sight really, maybe on the horizon a little bit, but 
you know, if it's a cloudy day, you can look up and you can look at clouds. You can you can go cloud, you know, seeing. You can make uh, shapes out of the clouds and, you know, spot some dinosaurs up there and spot some rubber duckies and all kinds of different stuff. So, you know, it is, you know, and then your hands free and you just kind of got to tilt the wheel a bit, you know, to make sure you're still on track. Keep your eyes on the road every once in a while. But, yeah, you can just... You can kind of just sit in the middle here and daydream up at the top. If if you didn't have this moon roof, you'd just be looking at tan, you know? You'd be looking at that. It's kind of boring. So yeah, this is what it is. Like I said, I like the moon roof. I'm really going to enjoy this when the summer comes. Not much use I have of it in November here. You know, we're thinking about Christmas and wanting snow to fall. And um, so yeah, not much, uh, not much to do with it right now, but in the summer probably just gonna have it open and like all the time I'll probably forget to close it as I park it in my garage and I'll just be like oh yeah the moon roof's open cool yeah I love it I love the tilt feature my old vehicle didn't have the tilt feature so but yep anyways let me know what you think of the moon roof is it worth adding is it not I like it um I I was on board with adding it from the from the get-go so it did hold up my order a little bit but you know, there's a lot of other things that are holding it up too. I took all those away, so I didn't get the spray and bed liner and, uh, you know, from Ford or anything like that. So that helped move it along faster too. So I got what I wanted. I dropped what I didn't need. Got it probably the same time I would have, even if I didn't have the moon roof. So just uh, make sure you're, you know, looking at constraints and things like that, seeing what everything's at. I think the moon roof is less constrained now than it was, um, you know, months ago. So definitely take a look into seeing if you want to get it added. But um, yeah, that is the moon roof. Let me get, let me know what you guys think. Uh, smash the like button, subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. Thank you. Bye.